hold on to someone. I'm not saying hold on to hope, hold on to um, your future, hold on to an idea, hold on to someone. Even in the world of, say, unbelief, what happens? If you're at the point of like giving up severe depression or suicide, what do you do? What do you do? You call somebody. You go to a doctor. You go to a therapist, correct? There's somebody professional, isn't it? Is it anyone that you're going to talk to to get the help? No, you cannot. You talk to, you hold on to someone. Now, in this way of tariqat, you are at that point where you feel like giving up. You have to hold on to someone. It's not to say holding on, oh, I'm just going to ask for medat. Obviously, medat is not reaching to you because you're at this point of giving up. <laughs> so you need to speak to someone. You think it is difficult to speak to the sheikh, speak to his vekil. Difficult to speak to his vekil, then speak to someone that he has assigned. Speak to someone who has gone through that. Speak to someone. Hold on to someone. Open your heart. Instead of opening your heart to your ego every single day and fighting with your ego every single day and your shaitan, being quiet and thinking and fighting with your shaitan, opening your heart up to the shaitan, speak to someone in the way of haq. Open your heart. If you have any questions, ask the Ahli Zikr. That is an order from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. There is an Ahli Zikr amongst you. Hold on to them and ask them. Speak to them. Because only shaitan is going to give you hopelessness. Because your ego can make you what they say in English, British, yeah, can make a storm in a teacup. One teacup, like a big storm. You thinking it's a big storm? Chai what? Thinking it's a big storm, but it's only one teacup. But to you, it's very big because you're staring at it. You're not looking somewhere else. You need to speak. It is the way of shaitan and your ego. Says, Don't speak to anyone. Consult with us. Don't speak. Nobody understands you. Nobody cares. Nobody will listen to you. Just listen to us, ego and shaitan saying. And you are consulting them every day. Talking to them back and forth. Fighting with them. But just now, to pick up the phone, to text, to do something to someone who has that authority, a professional in this way. Why are you hesitating? You're hesitating because the ego is saying, don't. Fight against your ego. Maybe it is a storm in a teacup. Maybe they will take that huge storm and they'll put it into a teacup. They have that power to do that too. Inshallah, it will be easy for you. Hopelessness is coming from shaitan. Don't be hopeless. Then that time when you speak to them, listen, be sincere, obey. When you go to a doctor, you must obey to the medicine. Doctor is saying, take three times a day. You have to do it three times a day. That is your medicine. When you speak to Ahli Zikir, listen to them. Be obedient. That time cure will come to you. Whatever that you've gone through, it is not something new under the sun. It is something that so many have gone through, especially in this way. Thousands have gone through. 
they've gone through and they've come back, they've gone through, they can show you the way again. Wa bina Allahu tawfiq al Fatiha. Amin. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. This much is enough.